Hey, this is Firestarter. Welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 with the Old Gods DLC. Uh, right now, I'm just trying to gather up enough money to sustain some wars here. So, uh, let's go ahead and do that. Let's embark. And head all the way down here. Money seems to be uh, too easy to get now. I'm going to go ahead and attack this little army. I uh, was hoping to capture somebody else. Possible loot 9. I don't feel too well. Something is wrong with me. I'm burning up with fever. Uh, please kill me. I have to ill trait. Which is not good. Oh, my daughter is my heir. But I really want a son. Well, let me talk to one of these guys. I know that there is another uh, feature of the game. A concubine. Wow, that's a nice stewardship skill. And she wants to get married. Well, I can try to take her as my concubine. And, well, he will accept that. To the most excellent fire starter, may you live in harmony and contentment. I have decided to accept your suggestion to make Enya into your concubine. So, pretty much... Okay, my fever is gone. Awesome. Uh, okay. Not sure how many concubines I can have, but... They're my breeders, I guess. I mean, I can lay them without... Um, having to worry about consequences I think I'm just curious about what happens to the children if uh, if they're gonna be fully legitimized or not so we'll see and if you know let me know in the comments or I'll just figure it out either way okay so I think we've got all the money we can get here we have some raiders here I'm pretty sure, let's see, there's a uh, river here, and I'll be getting off a boat, so I think I'll have uh, all that negatively impact me. So I'm thinking maybe I'll lose this battle if I go to Doman. I'm just going to come down here to Desmond. They left Doman anyway. Yeah, this is pretty awesome. Like a true viking just pillaging everything. Alright, looks like we're done here. We can't uh, raid them anymore. Okay, after I bring this gold back, I'm going to go ahead and declare war on somebody else. I'm going to create that title, become Duke. Cool. Yeah, we're at capacity here anyway. Sixty gold and sixty prestige. Awesome. All right. Yeah, I can't declare war if I have raised levies. So let's declare war on this guy. Oh. Now I now. It shows I must have a Cass's belly. And he's an independent. He wasn't an independent a while ago. This guy. I must have a Cass's belly. 
Well, if I would have a son, I saw this thing where, uh, this ambition where I want to become a uh, king. So this region here is really unstable right now. Well, that's unfortunate. So what am I going to do with my money right now? And also, let's check out my uh, prisoners. I'm going to go ahead and unpause the game. And set my marshal to train troops at actor instead of suppressed revolts. I don't think they'll revolt against me. I need a son. And I want to become Duke. And it's too bad I can't declare war on this guy. Alright, what am I going to spend my money on then? I have a city, yeah. A temple and a city here. Oh, all this stuff costs too much. 600 gold? Alright, how am I going to improve my uh, capital here? Why don't I get uh, fortifications or actually castle walls? That'll increase levy size, tax income, and fort level. Go ahead, do that. And bring out my uh, military again. So I can go ahead and uh, do some more pillaging, I guess. Him. Why can't I merge him? Maybe I have to toggle on both looters. Alright, cool. Embark. Yeah, they're uh, full up again, so let's go ahead and unload them. of their gold is protected, especially when compared to other places here. Oh, I don't have enough troops. Alright. Oh. Uh, they don't have much gold to loot here. But. Yeah, I'm sieging them right now. Lately I've become afraid that someone might want to hurt me. I am thinking about hiring a... No two food tasters and maybe a bodyguard. Would that be a good idea? I have a chance to get this paranoid trait. Intrigue 2, but diplomacy minus 1. Or trusting. Intrigue minus 2, diplomacy plus 1. Intrigue skill is a primary attribute of the spy master, high intrigue uh, improves the chances of uncovering plots. Blah blah. I won't let fear rule my life. I'm gonna go with this. I'll go with trusting. Yep, the 45 percent for percent chance came true, and I've picked up the trusting trait. All right. Oh yeah, I wanted to check out my prisoners. I have two of them. Can I ransom them off? 25 gold. 10 coal. Uh, they don't even want her. Oh, I can use them in my next blot. I can't do that in 9 years though. Or for another 9 years, rather. 
we'll just go ahead and ransom off this one. Uh, they will give me 25 gold. Cool. Now, is this giving me gold as well? I have 16.2 on board right now. And 30. So I guess it is. And I'm ill again. Man, I need a son. Sounds like my upgrade uh, just completed. I'm gonna hold off before building anything else. Alright, looks like I'm gonna have to make another trip back after uh, looting this place. So this guy claims he would be a better spy master. Uh, he might be. By a little. Well, let's go ahead and do that. And set him to learn down here somewhere, I don't know. 665. Alright, I've looted everything I can here. And I'm full. So let's go home. The fever is gone. Awesome. How old am I? 36. And one children lack a guardian, so let's go ahead and take care of that right now. What do my vassals think of me? This guy doesn't really like me. And why? Because I have a female heir. I have short reign. And envious. Well, let's have you educate my daughter then. Sort by rank, right there. Yeah, if I were to call out uh, Vassal Levies, uh, he'll give me more. Cool, I have 216 gold. Let's. Oh, I. Man. Let's go ahead and set up our guide to fabricate claims at Telemark. Probably should have been doing that all along. And let's work on another upgrade, maybe. Maybe at Agder. I'll just do castle walls. Alright, let's embark. Come down here, let's hit up Desmond and Thoman down here. Also, can I mess with my technology now? Nope. She's pregnant. Hopefully it's a son. Oh, that was my concubine too.
wonder how many of those I can have. In fact, let me... I do have a female in prison? Can I... In prison four years, age four? And I got... This person who is married. However, can I just... I can take concubine. Alright, I guess I can do that. I wonder if three is the maximum concubines I can have. I mean, there's only space for three here. Alright, looted everything I can there. Let's just go to Ormon. to hit our capacity here. Hopefully I can raise some more ships. And my concubine is pregnant. My new one. A daughter was born. My god. I want to fulfill my ambition. Alright, let's go home and drop off the cash. This is just way too easy. I can't raise any more ships, although I can from vassals. No, this is fine how I'm doing it uh, right now. Alright. So let's just set up here. Uh, these counties up here might have uh, replenished. There you go. Although a lot of their gold is protected, so it's probably a lot easier to replenish. And none of this gold is protected. Another daughter. Victory's coming from here. I have to be. You can do it. Another two and a half gold. Wait, hell, I can just leave you here and keep <laughs> just that one territory and just keep doing this. I'm full anyway. I need another concubine. So, why don't I talk to one of my neighbors, maybe? Here in jail. She wants to get married. Diplomacy plus one. Cruel trait. I do not want it to have anything to do with that. Elusive shadow plus two martial, nine intrigue, two diplomacy. Craven. I don't know if I want that. I mean, she has some other good stuff, and her stats overall are pretty good. I'll just go ahead and take her and, and deal with it. Um, I might be able to get more than three concubines. Let me go ahead and talk to this guy. Let's... No? I think three is my max. 
Yeah, I don't see any more here. Okay. Let's go ahead and bark. Um, let's upgrade some more, huh? Castle Town, tax income plus two. I might as well go for it. Nothing else to spend this money on right now. And one child, and one, one of my daughters needs to be educated. Um, how are my vassals doing? Alright, they're pretty happy with me. And she's the heir. If I don't have any sons, uh, let's find someone that has some good stats here, like this guy. He has a lisp though. I don't know, I'm gonna choose him. 14 Diplomacy. He's 16 years old and gonna educate my daughter. Well, let's do it. Oh wait, that's a, a betrothal here. What am I doing? Educate child. I don't know. These seem like okay sets to me. Let's go ahead and just do that. Alright. Maybe next time I'll choose have a daughter ambition. My god. Yeah, this seems pretty cheap. My liege, during my stay at uh, Rogaland, I have found a great philosopher who has agreed to help me with my studies to enhance culture in the province. With your permission, I would suggest we employ him. I lose almost 12 gold, but gain 50 cultural technology points. Let's go, go ahead and do that. Plus one domain size for emperors and for kings. I'm not emperor or king yet. Opinion penalty for different cultures minus 6.2. Those are the, oh, I can do one up here too. City vassal opinion plus two. I'm gonna do that. I'm not gonna be a king for a while, so I'm not worried about that. All right, let's move on to Desmond. Castle Town has been built very nice. I need see, I need to have a son to fulfill fulfill my ambition so I can go ahead and get the ambition to become king. Or wait for this guy to uh, fabricate claims, which is taking him forever. Capacity, so let's go ahead and drop this off. Sixty gold, sixty prestige. Pretty awesome. Oh, 
75 gold. Wow. We can just make one trip there and one trip back. Do that real quick. And I think we can, uh, if I read everything right, we can, yeah, we can go up and down rivers. Okay, please be a sun. Actually, why don't we just stop right here? Oh, Norse religion can't do that. Slavic pagan. Can we raid other pagans? Let's find out. Well, obviously we can. Oh, cool. I'm also uh, sieging him. Okay, my wife is pregnant and concubine is pregnant. Busy guy. Currently have 5.1 gold. Let's see what happens after I uh, siege this place. Another daughter was born. How much gold do you have now? 9.4. I don't know, maybe I can capture. Oh. They're on their way down here. Let's just go ahead and get in our boat now. Let's do what we originally planned to do come down to here. It started as an uneasiness around guests and strangers, then evolved into awkwardness and strong feeling of discomfort. I don't want to meet any new people, which will give me shy. 45% chance of getting spy, or 45% chance of getting this, which gives me plus two diplomacy. And I picked it up, plus two diplomacy, awesome. All right, 117 gold? The Byzantine, all right. Well, to keep that in mind when I have uh, more boats. Another daughter was born. I can't believe it. I probably can't carry any more gold. Nope, I can. And I'm going to babysit my dude here because... Where are you going? I think he's on his way here. Yep. Yeah, let's get in the water. Pretty much at capacity, so let's go ahead and drop it off. It's just faster to circle this area. Now, how can I raise more boats? I mean, I can raise the vassal ones, but they'll become unhappy. Well, let's see if uh, the raiding becomes faster with more people. Oops, that was my fleet. I should have just loaded you guys. Embark, and then move over here. Guess it doesn't really matter, I'm not really in a hurry. Merge, loot. Um, let's bring boats into port. I can't bark. I don't have no ships. Oh. 
Where's my vassal ships as well? Let's see how unhappy this makes them over time. Alright, merge. And embark. Alright. Let's move on over here. You can carry 140 gold now. Awesome. Might as well siege them, I guess. Alright, Chancellor. We need... I'm obviously not um, going to have any sons. 41 years old. Okay, I can hold another great plot. Who is in my prison? One prisoner. H9. Will someone... No. Alright, let's hold the great plot. Okay, who am I sac- well, obviously I'm sacrificing- Oh, what? I have no prisoners? I guess I can't sacrifice a young person. I lose 50 gold. Let's see, as you have no prisoners, uh, prisoners languishing in your dungeons that are suitable for the sacrifice at the plot, you're forced to make do with some randomly purchased thralls. As, uh, okay, they are brought up to the big oak outside the temple, and soon their limp and lifeless bodies are hanging from its thick branches. All right. Okay, please be a boy. Morale of armies improved. After a, succe a successful siege, your men drag Gormleth. Age 2. I actually had to drag her out of her hiding hole. <laughs> okay. Who is she? Not his daughter. Your daughter of a spy master of Tyrone. Okay, this area. You know, he may buy her back. A daughter was born. Man! I have 70 gold from all this already. Just from sieging here. This is the only place I've been to so far. Alright, so some other guy wants to be my seer. Um, my seer has 10 learning. Who's also my vassal. This guy has, what, 10 as well. Since my seer is my vassal, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna keep my vassal as a seer just to keep him happy. How much gold do I have now? 112. Oh, this is awesome. Let's just move over here. And that should fill me up. If not, I'll just... A famous writer proposes uh, to compose your family chronicles. I'll pay him. Alright. 
Let's go ahead and drop this money off. Hundred thirty nine gold, hundred thirty nine prestige. You know that's really cool. Almost four hundred gold here. Forty three years old. All these daughters. I need a son. I mean, I'm thinking about killing my wife and marrying someone else just because I want a son. When hell, I'm trying with four women and I can't get a son. This is terrible. have enough troops to siege here. Right after we loot here, I'm just gonna go to Doman. Alright, we need to educate one of my children here. Sort by rank. my concubine educator. I mean, she doesn't have bad stuff here. Maybe if she's happier, she'll give me a son. We can go back down to the Byzantine area and uh, loot them. Maybe we'll do that after our rounds here. educated as well. I can't believe they're just letting me loot everything here. Do they want to fight? No. My leech, my work in Telemark has come to fruition by bribing and blah blah blah. Looks like uh, he's able to fabricate a claim on that county. I will use it. Awesome. So I do not want him attacking me right now. I need my army uh, for this war. So we're going to fabricate a claim against this guy here. Alright. I can't declare war if I have armies out there. So let's go ahead and let him go. Talk to Warad. He's independent, so I cannot declare war. Oh, that was a bad move. I should have fabricated a claim right here.
You're not independent. Are you? Man. Alright, with my 500 gold... I need 600 for a castle. <laughs> I might as well go for that. So... Yeah, let's go ahead and try for that. Vassal levies too, why not? They, I'm not seeing prompts uh, of them letting me know that they're unhappy. And toggle loop. Uh, merge up our ships. We have almost a hundred people now. Let's go ahead and come down to the Byzantine Empire. Orthodox religion. Okay, someone else wants to be my spy master. Ten intrigue. To fifteen. He's my new my he's my new spy master. Awesome. Alright. Five six six. Let's go ahead and send him here to Prusa. Study technology. Awesome. Forty two gold is lootable right now. He has three thousand troops, so I have to make sure um, he's coming after me. Yeah. Let's move out this way then. Where's all the gold at? Well, I'll just land them here and get what I can. Looks like they may come after me after their uh, morale gets up there, but too late. part of that army. Oh, you know what? I have to end my video here. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care.